Hey guys and welcome back to As Question. I know I have not posted a, a video in a quite a wee while, but anyways, I'm back. To be honest, the only reason was I had no content to post because um, I just couldn't get any videos of me writing or doing anything. But anyways, we're back. We're here with a barn vlog today, so I've got a few things to do. If it wasn't for my granny, I would be mucking out this whole time, this whole entire video. But oh my gosh, I can't thank her enough for mucking out. So I only have a little bit of mucking out to do. And feed the boys, obviously, it is now pretty cold and wet. And saying that, it was quite hot a couple of days ago. But now, we're back to freezing cold. And it's probably going to stay like that now. But anyways... Still, all the boys are out in every single paddock, so if you watched my what we do to prepare the horses to go away, you'll know that they are both dropping weight and have not been gaining it. They've just kind of stayed at the same, they've put a little bit on, but it's hard to tell because they're also growing their winter coats. Anyways, um, so they're both completely out in all the paddock, which is sectioned up into different things for grass to grow, but it hasn't grown, so... Hopefully, fingers crossed, it'll go with this rain. But anyways, um, so they're out everywhere. And I'm going to make the hard feeds up first. It, I don't have too long, and then I'm hopefully riding, fingers crossed. So I don't know how much footage I'll get. It depends if I'm riding well, auntie's here, or if my dad's coming. So, Anyways, we'll probably brush them both. And hopefully brush Kiwi as well. Um, get a little Kiwi content. Anyways, let's make the hard feeds and do the hay. So here we have the hard feeds all made. The sugar beets getting ready to soak. I think I over soaked that. But anyways, now we have the hay nets. So the boys have a bit of a different feeding routine to what they're usually used to because now we're feeding, we're going to be feeding the horses morning and night instead of my auntie doing it it's just easier on her and us um so we're feeding we're putting three slabs and three hay nets of hay and then three of them are going out also they're just eating some spare hay down there look at how cute they are shearing anyways we're gonna fill these up three hay nets filled and ready to go out once I have done the bucket out. Headphones. <laughs> Here we are. Go through this dancer. Oh, she's going to smile. 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 Oh, I oh, thank you. <laughs> you good girl. Smile. Smile. <laughs> She's all muddy. Anyways, that's not my horse. There's my two boys over there. Let's go back out. So I was just working out that. And I realised that my siblings left this ball out, which isn't very safe. It's a carrot ball that you tighten. It's like really old. We just, to be honest, we found it in the pool pile. No, it wasn't in the pool pile. To be honest, I don't really know where we found it. It needs a good scrub. If we can... I'll chuck it over there. Hopefully we'll be able to... Sc oh! <laughs> good girl dancer. Anyways, picked up a couple of poos. Time to go on to that strip there. And that's all I need to do today. As long as I haven't pooed anywhere else. So it's swimming. So yay! Done the first wheelbarrow and pool, and just one more to go. Yay. So we can actually ride. Oh, it's gonna be rocky. Why is it so bad? This was here. Anyways. So, guys, last wheelbarrow done. They've come up and they're ready for a groom. But yeah, last wheelbarrow done. Do a few more bits before I groom them though. Good boys. 
So guys, I got a bit hot, so I'm taking my vest off. Um, but anyways, I'm now going to tie up this hairnet. And I usually tie these ones up just before I'm about to go. So I just take them down to the gate. Um, so they'll stay there and then I'll make up the feeds, mix them, and then track some hair out and bring the horses in. Oh, that's right. I'll give that a little scrub. See if oh right, the ball will get my cleaner. I doubt it, but anyways, let's go. They have both had um, I can't speak. Um, so I've chucked some hay out for them and tied up one of the hay nets and mixed the feed. And yeah, I'm now going to catch them and give them a brush. Oops. <sighs> Let's go. Let's hope you guys can see me. Come on, Rocky. He loves having the attention, but Kiwi's a bit grumpy. Grumpy old man. Anyways, I'm gonna brush Kiwi first since I'm not riding him. So I'll brush him and put his rug back on. Hey, grumpy old man. You're actually happy. Rocky and Dance are not happy. <laughs> Is because he's 
so little that the belly straps, no matter how tight they get, he always gets his legs caught in them. He's so good, he doesn't. Get me back. Ooh. That'd be seven. So, you guys, I'm probably going to hate it this way. And we're going to have to remember that he's very, very old. And that we are definitely trying to put weight on him. Like, he's out 24 7 at the moment. But there's just not enough grass. So, yeah. And he's ancient. And he's also. Ready for swimming. It's awesome. There's no ghosts in the grass. So, that's I do understand that he is skinny. And remember, he's not in work there. So, also, he's going to lose all of this. This top line and muscle and you are an old man and yeah you are very old man aren't you and you've got hair on it but yeah he gets rigged up nice and warm and to be honest he's got a big belly it's just up here I know we're going to bother to brush his face because he's got the most dirtiest face. I love his tail. I love the colour. He's got the cutest tail ever. Look at how beautiful it is. All the colours. Look at your face. Oh man. What have you done to it? There's no point in removing it because look, oh, you actually can't see that there's hay all over his face. Come down here. <laughs> We're eating the hay next. Anyways, you look a lot better. He's extremely fluffy, but we're gonna keep the fluff on to keep you all nice and warm, eh, can we? Okay, like, look at how big his belly is. Like from that angle, you can't really tell. But it's got a big fluffy belly. Right, you've still got hay all over you. Anyways, that's my little kiwi all done. I'm gonna put a heavier rug on because it's supposed to absolutely tear it down the frame soon. And then on to the mud monster. Hey, Dancer. You guys are best days now or are you still grumpy? He says, I don't like her being there. He's annoying. Good boy. <laughs> Happy half under the fence. Eating some hay. He's got his nice thick rug on. Even though it's just come out sunny, so goodness knows. But anyways, we're gonna do a before and after. So this is the nice muddy rocky. He's actually not that muddy, but you know, see he's still got his rug on. The one thing he gets is only his hocks dirty, his legs don't get that dirty. But look at this. What's all this? One night of rain. Seriously. Right. Let's go. Rookie. Guys, I am just dragging Rocky out 
to the arena to ride. I'm going to be walking around for ages before I wake my dad to come. Oh, sorry, I'm just going to get But yeah, he's all tapped up and I also need to pick up a pool out of the arena. Because someone did a poo the other day. Look, this is how low he carries his head. Especially when he doesn't want to do something. Anyways, we're coming. Aren't we? You're slowly coming, Rocky. Because I sucked at a poo in the arena. Down there. And uh, the arena's really weird. Oh well. That's all good. We're going to put my whip down there and change it out. Stay, Rocky. Put the fork. I'm probably going to have to put the camera away before I hit the horse with the, with the fork. Okay. I'll catch up with you once I've picked up the poo. Guys, um, I've picked up the poo. And I'm now going to hop on and ride. If I don't have a pocket, that's safely going to hold my phone so I can't film. But hopefully my dad will be here to get a little bit of footage of interesting stuff anyways. Because I'm not really going to be doing anything interesting whilst he's not here. So, let's go rock. It's not impressed. So guys, by the time my dad got there to film me, we had probably been riding around for about an hour in the arena, just doing lots and lots of trot work, because one of the rules is that I'm not allowed to canter without someone there. Um, so I had to wait until my dad is here, and this session, to be honest, was not that good. As you can see, pretty much the whole time I'm just kind of like asking him and just bouncing around on his back and I felt so bad, I was like, oh my gosh. We really can't get the canter. We were going so well for quite a wee while, but that's horses. Um, here we did get the canter. <laughs> I am learning to canter and he, to be honest he was very lazy that day. We did get a few good canters but he has a nice extended trot. just trying for most of the session but we did decide to end on a good note so I think after this or was it this trial I don't know it was after this try we got a really really nice canter I think it was after this try I don't know but anyways you can see I'm just bouncing around there and I'm like oh my gosh horrible but you know what let's keep it in and here's where we get a good canter, and then after that we finish the session off with some poles. Good boy. Hey, buddy. End on a positive, is it? She's cold. Yeah, it's freezing. I'll take it out here a couple of times. Do you like to stand in front of it? Oh, yeah. everyone you're in the video daddy hi you're in the video i'm in the video yeah oh. it's cold let's go <laughs> hey, let's go let's go yeah, let's go yeah 
Yeah, okay. We're going this way as well. <laughs> right, I need to go. So guys, we finished our ride. I'm just trying to swim around with one hand. Um, I'm just calling him off. The catering did not go that well, but it leads me to get some good friends. I think he's the second there even to be honest. Um, but yeah, that's alright. He's okay. We're cheer up. And at the end we didn't get a canter. And I'm going to get my phone back to Dan before he gets so good. So, yeah. You did well, didn't you, Rocky? You were good. We did a bit of pole work and lots and lots of trotting that you did not say. You just saw that gantering, which was the worst. I was all right, but anyways, I'm going to get my phone back to Dad. Oh, also, Dad, those are Indy's socks. She took them off when we were down here riding. The socks. The pink thing. And then the pink thing in the arena. Yeah, she left them there. <laughs> so we have to censor out his penis, unfortunately. <laughs> no, oh, she went again. I'm tired. She went again. Oh, three times in a row. What's up with that? Something wrong with your mouth. He says I'm tired. He's half asleep. Oh. I'll sleep here, me wiener out. <laughs> me dancer looking over me shoulder. <laughs> Time to put your hood on, so to speak. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna have to put a sign over that. But so you can't put it on your, your show. No one wants to see that, Rocky. Okay. I've had to actually eat it. You got your sports, bra, you got your sports bra on? Huh? You got a sports bra on? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, that's not the best thing. Introducing fat thumb. Do, do, do. Oh, fat finger. Fat finger. <laughs> fat finger. <laughs> no, I think he's... He's got a thumb. He's going down a bit. Yeah, he's going green. Okay, wait. Your mum doesn't love you, Dancer. Yeah. Ha ha. <laughs> hey guys, we're back home from the paddock. I hope you enjoyed that little barn vlog. I did... I'm just not happy to do the outro with me, so I'm gonna wrap it up quickly. I hope you guys. What? Alright, oh, I'm actually gonna start mine this way. Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed that video, and me and Aki will see you next time. Bye! Bye.